to Demon. spread hate. Yeah. Okay. But I gave you an example that mockery often, actually mostly, leads to dehumanization and demonization. Like I did with the Jewish people. I gave you an example that Hitler and other anti-Semites used imagery to mock the Jewish people. Can, wait, can wait, let me, let me, let me, yeah, 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 let me finish. Mock the, they mocked the Jewish people by using imagery of the Jewish people, making the Jewish people look very evil, right? By, by, by exaggerating the size of the nose and the claw on the world that the Jewish people are taking over the world by their money, by their influence, by their newspapers, by their political uh, whatever. Right, so Jewish people got de demonized, and as a result, dehumanized, and lo and behold, the Holocaust. Yes. One example. There were many Holocausts before. People don't. People, you know, the Jewish people do injustice to themselves. That they only talk about the Holocaust. They need to talk about the Jewish expulsion from England in the 13th century. Ju the back, Jewish back, expulsion from Spain. Years. Yeah, yeah. The Jewish people were brutalized. Full of and and who saved the Jewish people? Who stood for the Jewish people? Who took the Jewish people into their arms? The yes. Muslim in civilization. In the the Muslim, Muslim civilization. For 1,000 years. Madina brother, was brother, was brother, Jewish. brother. Bro I'm not Madina talking to you. Can you, can you. can you please talk? Jewish land. I can't ignore him because he starts shouts. People were Jewish, 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 Jewish in Medina. Listen, we moved away from you so that we can have this conversation. That was a yeshrab at that time. Thank you, thank you. That was a yeshrab at that time. So do you do you know do you know the history? Jewish was living there. Listen. Okay. Jewish was thank you. Thank and you. Muhammad, thank you. When Jewish, they open their hands. Can we continue with that? Muhammad, this is what these Christian head preachers do. Muhammad, they they don't want us to have the decent power, discussions. He started killing Jews. You know, these you know, head, you know, this religion. group of extremists yeah. in the park, they are yeah, the ones who don't want decent discussions. They don't the want intelligent discussions. To, uh, we're not listening to you. You okay. wasted your breath. Can I, I talk care. to these gentlemen? I don't care. Can I talk I to don't them? care about you. Can I talk at to them? At least, at least uh, they are listening. They are listening your lie. Okay. They are we listening know. your we lie. Know. We know. That we know. Madina was the city. Let the world see the Christian. Jews the the, the, the face time. the face of Christian missionary time. work in the park. Let at the world see. Time. Let the world so, see. So That's Muhammad, these, this is the face of Christian missionary. He the power. He killed Jews. Can't no, these are the sort of people who killed the Jewish people for 1,000 years. These are the sort of people. These extremists. They are the ones who brut brut brutalize the Jewish Muslim, people. Muslim, they moved from 1,000 years. Turkey. Okay. Muslim, they moved from Turkey and attacked Jerusalem. Am I right or wrong? So, so move. Uh, if you Am don't I right or wrong? Okay. Be right. Okay. Can we move the cameras on that the other side? We know, we know, we know our history. Okay. No. So I'm gonna get the. Uh, okay. We're gonna. Uh, we're gonna ask officer officer please one second peace, you I'm gonna get the police on you wait peace from Jesus. officer can I have some help we are being we are being extremely cold and the guy is getting physical and we ask we ask one uh, I'm having, having a conversation with a Jewish gentleman right, there yeah. and this uh, this Joshua this guy he is really actually right, getting yeah. into our faces All and right. he's trying to cause some sort of violence and we're not going to do that right, we, right. we don't want that so can you advise him to 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 be uh, gentle and walk away because we're not having it we don't want to talk to him okay. and he's getting into our faces we don't want to talk to him yeah and you can ask the people if you want yeah 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 so I mean, I'm, 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 I'm letting you know. Oh, I'm letting you know so that you know. Thank you for letting us know, right? Yeah. Can I say but, something without you taking offense to that, right? Yeah. If he's coming in your space, can you we, we are walking away, and he's, he's continuously following us. Keep walking away, sir. Thank so you, you want us to I, go I, around the park? Just go around the park, sir. Okay. I can't stop him from coming. Okay. To okay. No problem. We can talk here. And, and good. 
Let's try it. Grab another chair if you don't mind. Yeah, I'll, I'll pay for the chairs. Don't worry about that. I'll pay for the chairs. Uh, yeah, I'll pay for the chairs. No problem. I'll come to you. Don't worry. I'm not going to run away. Yeah? Okay. Okay. So let's sit down. No, he's not back. No, no, he's not back. He's not coming. Let's sit, sit down. You to stand. I like watching you relax. Oh, come on, man. You, I, don't, I don't look good sitting down a lot. No, no, no. I have courtesy. It looks like I, you can save two pounds fifty. Okay. So, so, so let's let's continue with our discussion. So the point I was making was earlier. Uh, that the, the Jewish people have a very unique history. The Jewish people, out of all people, they should be the first people to defend the Muslims against Islamophobia uh, and, and dehumanization and mockery of the religion and their sacred personalities. Uh, because Jewish people suffered the most, historically speaking, as a minority in the Christian lands and in the Muslim lands, right? In the Muslim lands, the Jewish people were given refuge, as I claimed earlier. You seem to have a view that uh, the Jewish people suffered as much as they suffered with the Christians. No, 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 no way. No okay. way never, You're not saying no that. Never, You're not never, saying never, that. Never, no. So what, what's, your, what's your view no, on... Let, let's go back, first yeah. of all. Yeah. Back to the first stage. I think we'll all agree yeah. we condemn Islamophobia in every shape or form. Okay. And that's unnegotiable. That means no human beings should be dehumanized. Right. That's, but that's on the perpetrator. Hmm. Now, as part of the victim, I think, I think where we would disagree is I believe that the best tool to fight dehumanization is to ignore and not to engage and, no, not, and if, not to defend. But then if you, if you ignore, you get the Holocaust. How, how do you ignore someone like Hitler? Uh, when the governments are, for example, defending mockery of a particular people, be it religion or an ethnicity, when the governments are funding and backing and supporting dehumanization through mockery of a religion and a people, how do you ignore it and how do you ignore the no, consequences? Mean, because, because the Jewish people in Germany in particular, if not other lands, they were dehumanized through mockery because Hitler and his entourage used specific language and imagery against the Jewish people to destroy the Jewish people of Germany, right? And, and he was he was able to do it because he was he was ignored. He was ignored not only by possibly by the I'm, I'm sure Jewish people didn't ignore him because they were the the victims, right? But the the, the world at large. The Western world, in particular, ignored until the Holocaust had already taken agree, place. I would agree. I agree with yeah. you on that. So we don't want to. No, I'm talking about the lone wolf that dehumanizes. If I walk on the street, yeah, and you'd have people scream, Hitler Jew, was not a lone Jew wolf. Or, or Heil Hitler. Hitler then, was. Then what I would. I'm not talking about Hitler. I'm talking about the lone person in the park, the lone person on the street. If I go up and confront him, I don't know what tomorrow he's going to come with his friends and no, meet no, me again in an alley. So what I would do is I would walk across the let's, street. Let's, and, let's and, not and, talk and about individuals. Let's, let's ignore the individuals because individuals uh, don't usually cause social impacts unless those individuals are a leaders, leaders, leaders of people. countries, right? But individuals, Tom, Dix and Harry's walking on the street with a mockery on the T-shirt or something like that, they can be ignored. I agree, right? They shouldn't be engaged with. And they should be ignored. Uh, yeah, yeah, 100%. But when mockery becomes a state policy and, so, and, uh, yes, uh, and, and, then, and then you have to and, fight. and newspapers like Charlie Hebdo are mocking the prophet of Islam or the Muslim people or the Jewish people by painting their noses big and the claw on the on the planet Earth and things like that this mockery against the Jewish people against the Christian people against the Muslim people right. this is uncivilized it is evil it is barba barbaric to say that this and is not civilization and, and dangerous, and dangerous. So, so you the Jewish people out of all people in the world you should be the first people to stand Stand up for the Muslims globally and say enough is enough. We are an example of suffering, and and people and who I agree have, with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you, the, 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 but we don't. Unfortunately, China, we don't see that coming. That worry the most about it here yeah. in Britain, especially, is the board of deputies for the Jewish. The board of deputies is the one that keeps some bang on the table about the situation the in China Muslims. with these Muslims, there, right? Okay, Uyghur. Uyghur issue is a political, politically convenient. Uh, uh, card to play today because uh, America has an agenda against China. So America as a government, as a state, is the last state to speak against
against the Uyghur oppression because Americans are the ones who killed three million people in Iraq, right? So, 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 we, we, Americans, uh, uh, Americans sympathizing with the Uyghurs is like the wolf sympathizing with the with the uh, with the with the herd of sheep, right? Uh, it's, it's like wolf going to the sheep and saying, "I am here to protect you. I'm gonna protect." Uh, come on, right? We're not we're not foolish anymore. Why are the Muslims so quiet about it? Uh, about Uyghurs, yes. Muslims are not quiet. You're not you're not looking you, you, you at Muslims. Hear nothing of the noise. I don't want to get into politics, but you hear none of the noise compared to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. No, 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 no. It's equally. It's equally. Uh, Muslims are speaking of. Uh, to, to Muslims, uh, Palestine-Israel conflict has a different sort of uh, dimension. Uh, dimension, absolutely. Why? Because uh, Al Quds is sacred space for Muslims as well as for the Jewish people. The humanitarian people. element of it. Yeah. So if you look on the numbers of people that are killed, for example, the numbers in China are far greater. The suffering that they're enduring is far, far, far greater. Right. Much less noise about this. I'm just I'm asking. As a lay no, 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 no. You, you, you have a misconception. The, the Uyghur issue is highlighted it's a, because it's a new issue, and how we don't know how long it's going to go on for. So uh, there is. It should go on for another day. Sorry. It shouldn't go on for another day. Absolutely, hundred percent. If it was uh, in our hands, it would have been. It would have been stopped by now, right? But because it's a new, recent issue, and not many people are actually aware of the impact the Chinese government is having on Uyghur psychology, Uyghur existence existence for that matter we're not yet aware of the full extent but with Palestine Israel conflict uh, it's been an ongoing conflict for the last uh, 70 mean, years no, and and for that reason the okay, impact sorry. is well known yeah. the impact is well known okay. Gaza is a concentration camp right I'll, the Palestinian people don't have the right to move around okay I was no, 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 I said we're not gonna go into politics but I, I'm really sorry I, I really I don't take your answers. I understand why you want to talk about politics when it comes to Israel. I understand really completely, I right? My fair share yeah. of politics, political but, conversation. But as human beings, as as yeah, simple human right. beings, I spoke purely yeah. the humanitarian cause, yeah. right? Yeah. If you look on the humanitarian cause, hmm. the cause in China, by all by the evidence that is available as of now, hmm. right? Hmm. And there's quite good evidence. It looks like many, many more people are suffering there and enduring sure. much greater suffering than the people of Palestine. But that's a political before. question. You said you don't want you don't want to indulge in no, politics. No. No, so I'm asking why is there so, oh, so much noise about Israel-Palestine, which tells me that the Muslims are really concerned about humanitarian causes. Okay, and if, if you are, and when there's nothing about their own brethren in China. Let me let me let me quickly address that point. The you reason that it's not the enough. reason it's why been going on for a couple of years already the situation. Good enough. If I would hear that a Jewish if, people if are suffering you, anywhere in the world, I wouldn't wait for years to see the psychological. First of all, I would look start. at Muslim history. Whenever the Jewish people suffered in the world. And they sought refuge with the Muslims. Muslims gave them refuge wholeheartedly with open arms. Okay, uh, there was no perfection. They, except when they were the perpetrators. Uh, when were the perpetrators? Uh, when were the perpetrators? I when, mean, I know that. Uh, easy to put it when they weren't under Ottoman Empire. They weren't under Spain. They weren't. And that's pretty much a thousand years. Yes, pretty much a thousand it, years. It country, yes. <laughs> so you're just making my point. Yeah. You just made yeah, my point. The, for a, the, for a thousand years, Muslims protected the Jewish people and, and in Spain. Grateful. And we are grateful for those. It's very and much. I am the grateful gold, that you're grateful. And, and but now we years. need, now we need your support, our Jewish brethren, our Semitic brothers. We need your support. Not that we we uh, we we're not going to do what we want. We have to do politically and intellectually, intelligently, uh, for our well-being, our existence. But if the Jewish people were to support us. Us, it would be very easy for us because Jewish people are very powerful, no doubt. Okay, Jewish people have know, a I, lot of influence. I'm right? like David. I'm okay. like David against Goliath. I'm the one of <laughs> yeah, but David was very powerful. He yeah, had God's he, power. That's why with I'm him. David. Yeah, he had God's power with I'm, him. I made, right? I made it rain today. <laughs> okay. Listen, <laughs> right. Listen, okay, but there has that. to be a two-way street anyway. Yeah. No, it is. It is. Look, our two-way street is our thousand years history. We, we, our, our behavior with the Jewish people, look at it. The Jewish people were facing extinction in the Western world. Okay, when I say the Western world, I'm talking about the, the, the majority, pre majority. predominantly Western Europe, right? The Jewish people were brutalized, exiled, killed, and converted forcefully. Yeah. When the Muslims came to Spain, yes. the Jewish people there were being forced to convert to Christianity, Christianity, right? And Muslim people came in, and lo and behold, it was five centuries, times, five times, centuries golden of golden Jewish era. golden age, right? Uh, your scholars like <laughs> Musa bin Maimoun, Maimonides yeah. Rambam, Maimonides. born in Cordoba, yeah. uh, Judah Halevi, 
yes. right? Samuel Hanagi, yes. okay, Hazda ibn Shaprut, yes, Prime Minister of the Muslim Government of Spain, Prime Minister, yeah. Jewish, Jewish Prime Minister, yeah, yeah. right? And then Ottoman land, Salonika. Uh, Istanbul, uh, yeah. when I say Istanbul, I mean Constant Constantinople, uh, Galata, the neighborhood, the Jewish yeah, courts in Jerusalem, where the Jewish people had their own beth dins, they could do and they do, they, they could do their own cases. And, and I, said, I said, and I, and I don't want to lessen the greatness and, and, and the gratitude we have for those years in those countries, but at the same time, let's not forget what you had happened at the same era in Yemen, in Morocco. At the same time, you had it depended on which type of, of you could call it, Muslim domination you had. When was this? What period at, are you talking about? the same about? period of Moshe ben Maimon, the, the Heilig Rambam, the Holy Rambam. Oh, you're talking about the uh, al -Mohad. So I have spoken. Uh, absolutely. I agree. I have spoken with Joseph about this, that al mawahidun You see, there were, there were periods of persecution, no doubt. But those periods were temporary. They were uh, uh, they were very limited in the scope, the biggest and they were reg they were regional. They were not widespread. To me, it's far more important to focus on the times we had good times together Absolutely. than to focus on Absolutely. what divides us. A thousand years. If we want to go what divides okay. us, we can go back to the Listen, conception of, 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 uh, if, if, of if if we look at a tree, and we see the fruit on the tree, we see the fruit on the tree, right? Uh, the tree is full of beautiful fruit, colorful, ripe fruit for us to pluck and eat. Okay, and there is rotten fruit on the tree maybe one or two branches or one or two pieces, right? Are we going to focus on the rotten fruit? That's what I said, it's far easier and far... Thank you. We so far so, more so talking about the rot... I mean, when I would look at tree and I see fruit on the tree, I would say beautiful tree with beautiful fruit. I'm not going to focus or magnify the rotten fruit. So that's why Islam's history with the Jewish people is like that tree with beautiful fruit. Don't because we, you know, even the language, yeah. The Jewish, la the Hebrew language Alamalek, revived. Alamalek, yeah, and, yeah, no, no. I mean, I'm not talking about the similarity. I'm talking about the revival of the Jewish uh, Hebrew language, the Yiddish uh, dialect, and all that. I mean, I don't know how the origin, the origin of the Yiddish dialect. No, Yiddish but, is, no. no, put it this way: wherever we live throughout yeah. history, no difference if it was yeah. in Arab countries yeah. or it was in Spain. Right. The Jewish people always used the language within the country we lived in hmm. and Judaized it, as they call it. They, right. they spoke it in an interesting so, dialect. So, and so now that it's raining, uh, Rain. sorry, yeah, what's yeah, your good and name? We all, and, we all get, and we're all yeah, getting wet. So, 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 so your good name, I've uh, denounced you. Aron. Aron. And your, your good name? Yo. Yovel. 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 Okay. No, like okay. Yovel. Y U V E L. Y O E L. Okay. Y O E L. And I'm like the brother of Moses. Okay. Okay. And my name is like the brother of Moses, Aaron. I was born on the day of his. So, so gentlemen, you as, as you as practicing Jewish people and I myself as a Muslim, we agree that mockery leads to dehumanization 100%. and demonization that that causes people to be killed uh, uh, on a massive scale, like it happened to the Jewish people. We don't want that repeated with the Muslims. I agree. Okay. And we would never allow that to happen to Jewish people. Again, exactly. as Muslims, we stand as the defenders, as the protectors whenever we are needed. Not, not, not that the Jewish That's people need us anymore. Not that the Jewish people, the Jewish people are very powerful. No, we are family. We are family. We, we, yes, we are family. Ismail and, and Isaac were brothers. Absolutely. But we need to really demonstrate that in Israel and Palestine conflict. I'm going to well. leave that out there, Ari, but where we do focus together is when it comes yeah. to shita, is to halal yeah. meat. I think we work yeah. together. A yeah, bit. I, I, I eat kosher. I eat no, kosher. I think <laughs> even, no, on, yeah. where we do, where we, you good, because... You, you've got good taste buds. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. I do, I do, because kosher is halal. Yeah. For me, kosher no, is... Uh, our prophet together. told us, yeah. our pro because the Jewish people, they, they read the name of God on the food, you eat it. You eat it, right? Uh, he was not an anti-Semite because he was Semite himself, right? What happened between him and the, the, the some of the Jewish tribes was because the history is well, is, is very clear on that. We have, we have two. Yeah. Let's put it this way: we have two different experiences. Yeah, yeah. That means you, no, have, even, you have the Muslim perspective and we have the Jewish perspective, but we're not going to go into what divides us. That's yes, the focus. Then. Yes, absolutely. There's, there's two absolutely. different perspectives for, for yeah. the people. I, I, I would I would recommend some books for you from the from Jewish historians who have written on these topics. One is Jacob Lasner. He's from from uh, the US, he has written about uh, uh, the Jewish experience under Islam. Then there is um, there is there is Bernard Lewis. You must know him. He was an expert in Islamic history. He uh, he died recently. Uh, although although not very sympathetic to the Muslim civilization, but he did uh, praise the Muslim civilization for the Jewish. What do you mean? The Muslim uh, civilization gave the world a lot, from algebra to much more. In, in the good, in this, the good days in Spain. I, I, in the good you, days see, in Spain. you see, when people Sunlight talk about and shadow, yeah? sorry, Sunlight and Shadow, the Jewish experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and the other book is uh, 
Christians, Jews okay. under Islam or something like that. We're get under okay. The yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, so someone needs to call. Guys, you need to bring your cameras and the mics are with me. Wow, man. We are getting This is away. Back.